In health and wellbeing today, we are talking about maintaining your fitness when you're pregnant. Now, some mums to be just aren't quite sure what is safe, particularly with the first baby. So we have pre and postnatal fitness and wellness consultant Lorraine Scapens here to give us some advice. Morning, Lorraine. Good morning. Now, okay. tell me, how did your regime change? You're the mum of three. Yep. How did your fitness regime change when you were pregnant? Oh, well, you know, nine years ago, before I was pregnant, I was a triathlete, so I was used to training for many hours a week and at quite a significant intensity. So pretty much as soon as I found out, I was pregnant I had to start to reduce both intensity and duration of my exercise Wow so the exact opposite of many people who go oh, yes. I'm pregnant I better get fit for this business. yes that's right so I had to really slow things down and have a look at the exercise um, and how I was going to moderate it and that's what I definitely suggest to mums if they do feel like exercising during that first trimester that's probably one of the things that they need to look at to reduce is the intensity and duration of their exercise okay so you've come up with a fit mum program um, can you show us yep. some recommend um, some exercises because conveniently you've brought along a yes. pregnant person Here's for Kate. Us to play with. <laughs> hey Kate. <laughs> so right, let's show us what you've got. What are some things that you recommend for pregnant mums? Definitely squats. You know, squats are a great exercise to do throughout the entire pregnancy. They're going to help improve leg strength, which is going to help prepare mums for birth. And then also it's going to improve core strength, help position baby into optimal position. So let's have a look at your squats, Kate. So perfect squats done nice and slow, always thinking about posture and technique right. and ensuring women are correctly connecting with the core muscles okay, throughout so exercise. Kate's quite, uh, what, 12 weeks pregnant? Yep. A little bit more difficult to do these when you're eight, week, eight months pregnant, isn't it? No, we actually need to do them because the positions that mirror what we could be in in birth. <laughs> so, you know, those, those perfect positions which help gravity, so help assist baby descend deeper down. So these exercises can definitely be done if there's no medical complications throughout right. an entire pregnancy. Okay. Yeah. Just got to watch that balancing because you've got yes. big bubble in front. Can you show us another exercise? Yes, we've got some slide outs. Again, what I've just mentioned, you know, core strength is important because core strength is going to reduce the risk of back pain. Mm. It's going to improve pelvic floor muscle um, connection. It's very important. It is. You know, we don't want to suffer from any pelvic floor trauma, you know, postnatal. Mm. So ensuring women connect with the core muscles, again, not only prevents lower back and hip pain, but can prevent pelvic floor muscle issues later. A lot of it's about preventing it yes, earlier on. Yes, it is, and we maintain that throughout the pregnancy, and that's what we're looking at, you know, exercise that's going to prevent back pain. Um, yes. What do most people worry about, or most women worry about when they're pregnant? Do you know, I would definitely think most women are going to be worried about the health of their baby and concerns of exercising but we know through recent studies that exercise shouldn't be a concern in fact we actually need to be encouraging more women to exercise during their pregnancies and not only as a benefit for them but for baby as well what about running things like that should you be doing that when yep. you're pregnant well you know I, I kept running I've just mentioned that I was a triathlete yeah, but and you it, you're something quite special and it was really <laughs> looked down on then and there wasn't much information available for mums and it is about listening to your body you know my I was used to running I certainly wouldn't suggest to any mums to take up running during their pregnancy but if they have been running if they've been going to exercise classes you just need to start to moderate things and see how you feel during your pregnancy there's a lot to suggest now that maybe women are doing we've gone too far we've been trying to encourage women to exercise okay. but have we now gone to extreme levels and it's not just as easy as listening to your body when you're exercising because music you know those right. exercise classes can start to um, change how we right. are listening to our so body. take a little bit of, of professional advice maybe might be the Definitely. right way to go. Well yep. it's been a pleasure having you both in the studio. Thank you so much yep. Kate. And best of luck with baby number two. Very exciting <laughs> times and thank you very much Lorraine too. If you want more advice on exercise during pregnancy check out Lorraine's website pregnancyexercise.co.nz and Lorraine's back with us next week with exercise advice for mums post-pregnancy.